good day ma'am and classmates. I am Hojaima Aliti Ante presenting my demonstration on anthropometric measures. Ang una po nating MM measure ay ang infant or ang mga baby na mula 0 to 11 old months old. First, nakukunin natin is the land of the infant. Dapat ang nanay ang siyang maglalagay ng baby sa infantometer at ang magmamessure ang siyang mag-aassist. Then after malagay ang baby, kailangan i-hold ang head ng baby to maintain the alignment. After ma-straight ang head at feet ng baby together with its buttocks touching the backboard, adjust the foot piece para makuha ang measure ng baby. The length of the baby is 63 cm. The next, the measure is the weight of the infant. The first procedure is to test the wing scale three times para malaman kung gumagana ba ng tama ang timbangan. The next is a measure ang nanay or the guardian ng baby. After Make sure na walang mabibigat na bagay or accessories sa katawan ng imemeasure. After makuha ang measure, ang weight ng nanay, imemeasure naman ang timbang kasama ang baby. Ang timbang ng nanay ay isasadyak sa timbang kasama ang baby. Then, the total is the timbang ng infant. Now, we will measure the mid-upper arm circumference or the MIWA with the infant standing erect and sideways to the measurer locate the mid-upper arm. Mark the area with a pen. Wrap the tape gently but firmly around the arm at the midpoint of the infant. Now we will measure the chest circumference of the infant. To measure the chest circumference, the shirt of the infant should remove but let the mother remove it. To measure the head circumference of the infant, we first hold the infant to the mother's lap. Remove the hairpins or headbands that interfere the positioning of the teeth. Anchor the teeth just above the eyebrows with a zero point on the side to him. Be careful not to compress the hair too tight. To measure the weight of the preschool first is to test the weighing scale three times para malaman if gumagana ng maayos ang scale. Then remove all the accessories to the body of the child. Have the child stand to the center of the scale platform with the hands at the sides at looking straight ahead. Wait until the ring of the scale becomes stable. To measure the height of the preschool, ask the subject to remove its slipper. Have the child stand firmly against the backboard and the both feet of the platform. Instruct the child to stand with the he heels 
together and a toast apart. Check the back of the head, shoulder blades, buttocks, and heels. Make the contact with the backboard. Height of the school children. Ask the subject to remove its sleeper. Have the child stand firmly against the backboard and both feet of the platform. Check the back of the head, shoulder blades, buttocks, and heels. Make contact with the backboard. To measure the weight of the school child first, this Test the wing skill three times para malaman if gumagana ng maayos. Then, remove all the accessories to the body of the child. Have the child wear light clothing and stand to the center of a scale platform with the hands at the sides at, and looking straight ahead. Wait until the reading, reading of the scale becomes stable. To measure the height of a teenager, ask to remove its sleeper or any hair ornaments. If mas matangkad sa iyo ang minimeasure mo, use chair to measure the exact height of the teenager. For the weight of the teenager, first, remove all the accessories to the body of it. Have the teenager stand to the center of the scale platform with the hands at the sides and looking straight ahead. Wait until the reading of the scale becomes wrist circumference. To measure the wrist circumference, first is to measure the elbow breadth using a caliper or a tape measure with the elbow flex at 90 degrees. Wrist circumference is measured at the smallest part of the distal to the styloid process of the ulna and radius. To get the waist circumference measured using a fiberglass tape or a tape measure at the so smallest circumference of the waist or midway between the lowest rib and the iliac crest. To measure the hip circumference using a tape measure, get the largest area of the hips usually the largest part of the buttocks. In taking the skin fold measurement, the person folds the skin from body area using thumb and index finger. Place the caliper in the fold skin and read 4 seconds after opening. 